Hey everybody! So I'd like to start out today by having you watch a few videos and try and figure out what they have in common. Here you go! Kidding me? Look at that. Woo! I'm real. Have you ever seen that before? I certainly haven't. So one common thread that went through all of these videos is that in all of them somebody was in one way or another messing around. Now many times in schools, messing around gets a bad name because people will talk about it as an excuse or a get out of jail free card for a lot of things that happen. But as you saw in those videos, there's a lot of positive things that can come from messing around. Now one benefit can be that it is spontaneous or you don't know what's going to happen. Like with the dance with that guitar player, or with the horse playing with the ball. Another benefit is that messing around can help bring people together. That guitar player and the guy who started dancing to him on the street didn't know each other at all, but they were able to make a connection by just essentially playing together. A really important thing to remember here, though, is that something that's appropriate in one situation isn't automatically appropriate all the time. Take, for example, that horse. While it's really cool to watch a horse playing around with a big ball at the beach, if that same horse were out there when the buses were arriving and everyone was heading out, that would be a really dangerous situation and not really as cool. And while it might have been cool to watch that bike rider slide his bike down the rail, that's an entirely different situation if those stairs are packed full of people and there's everybody around that he might run into. So even though everyone can pretty much recognize messing around when we see it, the line between what's appropriate and inappropriate is a little bit fuzzy because we don't talk very often about what is appropriate and inappropriate messing around. So for today's challenge, that's what I'd like you to do. So in your homerooms and advisories today, I'd like you to talk about what's appropriate and inappropriate messing around in the classroom setting. When you're done with that, please talk about what's appropriate and inappropriate messing around at lunch and recess time. All right, you take care. So if it comes at the right time and place and works for everybody, messing around can be a good thing.